I want to walk you through a project that I'm working on right now using the Cade Mini Console Plus. So what I have here is an old hot rod joystick. Uh, it's really a predecessor to the X Arcade. So what we have here is um, our basic arcade controls uh, for two players all set up ready to go. So what I did is I took the encoder out of this and I have right now, this is a prototype of um, the Mini Console Plus. Uh, the, the version, the, the maker version would work just fine in here as well. Um, not a problem, the exact same functionality. But what I have is I have the, the DB15, which is the, the input for the, the classic console controllers. And I have that routed up to the front here. So when it's upside down, this is just sitting underneath the lip here. And I can plug in my, my console controllers here. I also have the arcade expansion board in here wired in. And what this means is that any input either from either of these sources will be sent to whatever I have plugged in. In this one, I, I just have the USB connected. And what I have it hooked up to is a Raspberry Pi 2. So have heat sinks and things on it because I'm going to overclock it a little bit. And really, my, my outputs here... Um, I'm going to have HDMI and then power, and if I need to, audio, and that'll just get mounted here and hang out the back. So basically what I have here, um, as I get it all wired up and everything put together, got a little bit more work to do on it, um, have to put the wires on P2, but what I'll have is a self-contained on-the-go unit that can play... Um, arcade games and MAME and quite a few different emulators with the original controllers in one self-contained unit with everything here ready to go. So I can just bring this with me over to a friend's house. I plug in my power source on my Raspberry Pi um, and then plug my HDMI into their TV and we're ready to go with both arcade gaming and classic gaming at the same time. And again, one of the really cool things about this is that if you do put the Mini Console Plus inside of um, a cabinet or a fight stick or, or one of these kind of arcade controls, uh, the, the inputs coming from the joystick here will work at the same time as any of the classic controllers that I have plugged in here. So I can go ahead and navigate menus and things with the joystick if I find that easier. And then I, and I can have this plugged in at the same time. Um, I've actually tested it pushing the buttons on the, the classic controller and using the joystick from the arcade works fine, um, works seamlessly. So it's really up to your imagination what kind of projects you want. Um, you know, we, it supports many more things than just the Raspberry Pi. Uh, you, the brain of, of your emulation or your gaming can be all sorts of different things. But we're, we're really interested to see what kind of cool ideas you guys come up with for using this.